Hi, it's the Brook of That Gratitude Guy. I have a dream. Now that, of course, was made famous by Martin Luther King in the 60s. And I started thinking about it today as I was thinking about the dream I have to take this message and the power and the unbelievable way that gratitude can transform your life. But I noticed there's a lot of dream stealers around. There's always people that are trying to, well, here's what I would do if I were you. Here's what I would think about, you know, gosh, are you sure you want to quit your job? Whatever it might be. Be aware of those dream stealers out there and realize that the number one person that you want to communicate with is you about your dream. Because there are always going to be those little negatives, the little devil or the little angel, in this case, I guess the devil, that's going to come up and say, are you sure about this dream? I don't know if it's really reality. What are you doing? You're talking about gratitude? Is that really something that you can convert into a business or you can take across the country? I don't know. I'm not really sure. So think about the dream you have. And think about the fact that as you have that dream, nobody will be more passionate about it than you are. And be aware of who you're hanging out with because those dream stealers are everywhere. There's always going to be the people that are going to say, well, you can't do it. And here's why you can't. Get back, do a regular job, whatever it might be. But be aware of them. And the best way, the best way to counteract that is gratitude. Because gratitude will keep you reframed and refocused on your dream, on your passion, and on the patience it's going to take to make it a reality. That's the formula. I talked about that just a couple of days ago. So be grateful. Be aware of those dream stealers. Stay away from them when you can. But when you have to encounter people like that, consider the gratitude part of your life and everything you're grateful for, for having a dream and pursuing it and pursuing your passion. It will pay off. That dream you have, I have a dream, as Martin Luther King said, will come true. That's the message for today. Have a grateful day. We'll see you tomorrow.